The reason why I also didn't test 64 gigabytes is because for a similar and an opposite reason. For gaming, you just straight up don't need that much RAM unless your machine is primarily going to be used for production and then gaming is done on the side. The other thing is that 2x32 64 gigabyte kits are dual rank sticks and then you bring in another variable into the testing which is dual rank versus single rank and what we're more focused on is just capacity. Also with dual rank kits you can't clock them as high as single rank kits. In these tests we're going to be using two different single rank kits 2x16 and 2x24 which I've overclocked to 7600 mega transfers. Maybe in a future video I might test single rank versus dual rank if there's enough demand for for it. But since most people are moving towards DDR5, I wanted to know if 32 gigabyte single rank kits are the sweet spot or if you should pay the extra 50 or 60 dollars and buy a 2x24 48 gigabyte kit where you still get high frequency and I find it to be a nice middle ground